Hey guys, I'm John, here with Mishimoto and our patented X-Brace dirt bike radiator. If you're into power sports, chances are you've probably heard of us and how resilient these awesome new dirt bike radiators are. Here at Mishimoto, we push the limits, and when it comes to testing our products, we follow that motto. You know, we decided that stress and crash testing was just not enough to really prove how strong these X-Brace radiators are. We were thinking you could either crash your bike or, you know, kick this radiator around a little bit, but, you know, we're thinking maybe you just run it over with a car. Uh, that's not such a bad idea. Running over a radiator with a car might seem a bit excessive, but it's a great way to show the strength of our X-Brace radiator over the stock one I have here. The engineers at Mishimoto have designed a ramp just for this experiment, and we are actually going to drive that Subaru WRX over both radiators to test their strength against its weight and square force. Now I should probably tell you not to try this at home, so you don't damage a car or anything. But seeing as this isn't actually my car, I'll do whatever I want. First up, let's see how this stock rad deals with the pressure of being run over. All right, let's check out how our first test went. See, I would not trust this stock radiator on my dirt bike. If I'm going down, this thing is not gonna hold up at all. Round two, time for the X-Brace. Okay, but seriously, looks alone can't determine exactly how well these radiators stood up against our car, so we brought them inside to our Mishimoto laboratory for one final test. We're going to fill these rads with liquid to see if they'd still hold pressure or if they're going to leak after a gnarly crash. First, let's see how the stock rad held up. In one end, out the other. Let's see if the X-Brace actually survived. This was run over by a car and there are still no leaks. Well, here's your proof. Mishimoto X-Brace radiators push the limits.